What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2019 Panini Prism Football Hobby Two Box Break Number Six Tiered Random Teams just sold out. And you guys, randomized list, customer names, and the tier of list of cust uh, tiered list below. And again, two box break of Prism Hobby, no veteran base card ship, number ten spots. Cardinals, Falcons, Dolphins, all the way down to the Cowboys, Chiefs, Panthers, Saints. So here you go, dice roller, three to three six times. Customer names from Nicholas down to Ryan. And you got the tiers: Cardinals, Falcons, Dolphins, down to the Cowboys, Chiefs, Panthers, Saints. Six times. One, <clears throat> two, three, four, five, and six. Six times. Nicholas down to Matthew. That's why I said the next one because I mean Transcendence also coming up, and. Opti Prism mixers coming up, so it's like, man, I might pull a Zion 101 or something. That's why the next one's always the best one. Alright, six times. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Six times. Giants combo down to the Redskins. All right, Nicholas, you got the Giants, Browns, Texans. Kevin with the Cowboys, Chiefs, Panthers, Saints. Ryan, you have the 49ers, Ravens, Chargers. Kevin with the Broncos, Bengals, Colts. Corey, you have the Seahawks, Titans, Packers. Derek with the Patriots, Steelers, Lions. Joe with the Raiders, Bills, Vikings. Jesse, you have the Cardinals, Falcons, Dolphins. And Nicholas with the Jaguars, Eagles, Bears, and Jets. And Matthew with the Redskins, Rams, and Bucks. So quick 30 seconds if anybody wants to trade. If not, we're going to close it, start ripping, and then get to the next break. Someone wants to trade with somebody, Corey, we do offer that. But if no one replies and no one actually accepts an offer within the time frame that I give you, about a minute, 30 seconds, whatever it is, then I close it. If people really want to trade, they'll start chatting. But if not, then they stick with what they want. Actually, I got to name this. And yeah, I remember you had to trade the whole tiers. I don't think we allow you to trade one team out of the other. And it has to just be the whole tier, I guess. I don't think anybody's ever traded just the one. Gets just a little too confusing after that. Alright, you're good. Do you want to close them? Oh, sorry, Nick. Corey said he's good, actually, so. Stick with that. Just remember, guys, I know some people were talking about Flawless NBA. Uh, we have to sell out two spots straight up and then have to sell out the cello packs. Now, I don't know if there's another cello pack tied into that Flawless break, but there might be. Um, since we're only giving away seven spots. Just a little FYI. I'm not too sure if that's the only cello pack break we need to sell out besides the two spots straight up, but this needs to sell out with this together before we can break that flaws. Usually, the help with the filler break is usually always next to the original break, so that way you guys can see it. All right, so these are the last two boxes that I've seen there. It looks like Nick or Joe or me, one of us. Just put a line through them. So these are the last two.
for at least two autos. Brian Burns. Looks like it's the first one. A little silver auto. Hawks and Gardner Minshew rookie. Steve Young. 27 out of 99. I think a white side. Holy Cooker for two forty nine. Miles Gaskin to one ninety nine. And Zach Allen sensational signatures. Cardinals. So, uh, first auto was Panthers, right? Kevin and Cardinals would be Jesse. I like Ogletree. Josh Jacobs. Devin Singletary to 149. Oh, we got three autographs. I forgot about that. That's right. Football's a little different. Um, Bills. Joe with that one. Kyle Fuller to 49. How does what work, Dank? This break itself, or in general what we're doing? What up, Obi Juan? Doing well, man. How are you? Christian Kirk? Wow, that is a great question to ask because we have a great video for you to watch. Here you go. This is our video we made a couple years back introducing customers what is a group break. Definitely watch that video, man. It gives you a quick two-minute two minute video of what we're doing here. Oh, nice. Awesome. Well, definitely check out that video, man. Um, it's like a two-minute video. The link I just shared. It's called What is a Group Break? Kind of gives you a quick two minute insight of what we're doing here and what group breaks can be or what they are and what type of breaks there are. Put it that way. But basically, summing it up, you buy a team or you get a random team where you don't know what you're going to get. And uh, basically, if you got the Raiders, any Raiders hit to come out of the box, case, whatever the brick is, how many boxes there is, are yours. If nothing pops out, by, uh, unfortunately, then you don't get anything. But you're paying a fraction of the price than what it would have cost to buy a full box or a full case, which can be thousands up to $100 of boxes. And you may only pay 10 15 however much the team is or the random team spot may be. So you pay a small fraction. To collect your personal collection, collect players, teams, whatever you're chasing. Again, for a small fraction. But that video is pretty good. It's not that it's outdated. I think Transcendent had a release in 2015 at the time, but the most expensive product there was was like. Um, that one $5,000 box case from uh, Panini. I forget what it was called, but that was like the biggest one at the time. Then obviously Transcendent blew it out of the water, being like $20,000 plus. We should, Derek. Wouldn't that be awesome? I wonder how much a box is. Like 20 grand, probably. Nah, it has to be way more than that, right? Yeah, definitely. 
definitely, you know, read up, study on what it is. And, of course, you can ask me or whoever's breaking Joe any questions as much as possible. We'll try to answer uh, to the best of our knowledge. But, like I said, read the item descriptions and every break. You know, make sure you know what you're doing before you buy into the break. So that way, you know, you're not so surprised or shocked what's going on. Trace McSorley. 2k a pack and how many packs like 36 so yeah that's probably like a 40 50 thousand dollar back box now right damn that's crazy at the national they were breaking that for 2000 a pack i remember that john the neighbors alec ogletree Calmado, Tuan. That's not what we do here. We bring joy. We bring the hobby to you guys from home. Safer at home. <laughs> you don't even have to go to the you don't even have to go to the store anymore. You can just buy personals from us. We can break it for you. We can ship it to you. Foster Mar no, but yes, honestly guys. Obviously, this can be a game of strategy or a break of strategy where you buy the best team, get better chances to hit, or et cetera, et cetera. But it really is. It really is all based on luck, honestly. Because we don't know what the hell is popping out of here. They give us a checklist to let us know potentially what can come out of here, but we still don't know what's coming out of here. You know, so. But again, bringing joy also brings probably sadness, which I feel you. I've been in that situation. I've bought into many breaks before. Not recently because I just don't have good luck. I honestly don't have good luck, guys. I mean, I don't know if you guys want to believe me, but I don't. Here and there, I still buy into some player breaks on eBay, other places, and I do not do good. <laughs> like, I just don't. I pull fire for you guys, but I just don't pull fire for myself. It doesn't work that way. If it's not mine, I pull fire. If it's mine, it's not. <laughs> I have the best luck for you guys, probably. I mean, not everybody. I'm sure some people hate me, which is understandable. You know, sometimes I'll hit something really nice for you, and then sometimes I'll go on a hitless streak for like two, three weeks. But at least the good thing for you guys is you guys get a mixture of me and Joe. So if I'm not doing good for you guys, then Joe is. And if Joe's not doing good for you guys, then you can switch it up and come to me. And it's best of both. Or you just don't have any good luck with any one of us, which that can happen. But for the most part. But yeah, it's true. Yeah, everybody does want to fun. But you just got to continue to play if you can. Sam Darnold. All right, there you go, guys. For personals, Trevor, it's only because we only may have um, however many is available there for personals. That's probably why it's only allowing you to buy one pack. If you're trying to buy on jazbees.com, it's because some customers have already opened that box and we want to make sure that we don't oversell. So if it's only allowing you to buy one, then that means there's only one pack left from that box. If there's two, that means two pack, etc., etc. If you want to buy a whole box, obviously you can still buy a box if it's available. But if not, then just those packs are available. So there you go, guys. This was Prison Football Hobby 2-Box Break, number 6, tiered, random teams, jazbeescasebreaks.com.